couldn't be go five peeps. This is how we do it. I'm just singing to get through it. Anything else you know that? No, that's it. What's up my Trinbago Vibe peeps? Welcome to another edition of Trinbago Vibes. In this one, we are going through a few drive throughs here in Trinidad and Tobago. The weather not all that righteous. So we're just going to get some drinks. Yeah, some warm-ish drinks in this one. And we're going to talk a little bit about YouTube, especially here in Trinidad and Tobago. You know, Caribbean, well... I'm gonna say Trinidad and Tobago, right? So the first drive through this morning is Starbucks right here in La Romine. It's opposite Cow City Mall. So yeah, I just gonna get me, I mean, chocolate and coffee, right? Yeah, a mocha, yeah. Hi, good morning, medium mocha. Sure, the total is 37, you can try for a drink. Thank you. Yeah, so who doesn't like something warm when the weather is like this? It has been raining these past few days right here in Trinidad and Tobago. All right, let me just go collect this. Thank you so much. Same to you all. Mm. Yeah, I tell you, not too sweet. And especially, I don't take the whipped cream in it because we don't need that extra sugar in our life at the moment. So as we head to the next spot, let's tackle some questions I get about starting a YouTube channel or having one here in Trinidad and Tobago. But that was surprisingly well for the first drive through right there in San Fernando. Normally there's a few more people and it looks like the weather is actually holding up. Right now we're on the Narsaluda Mayamaj Road right here. But we had into extra food plaza for the second drive through. Yeah, there's our next Starbucks drive through here so this time it more central ish and while we go through this one let's talk a little youtube it looks like regular traffic here at extra fruit plaza for our second drive through you know i'm surprised there's no big setter line here like it normally has anyway youtube well first let's place an order you know what i'll, I'll i could get the um the pumpkin spice the frap instead pumpkin spice frap yeah anything else no that's it $38, right? Alright, thank you. Well, that completely went astray. I wasn't expecting to get that. I was actually going for coffee, but you know, it's that time of the year. I'm not too much of a fan of it, but for this video, let's get it. Let's see if I can change my mind. This time I'm getting the frap. Next spot, I'll just get coffee. So we started off with a mocha, then we are drinking a pumpkin spice frap. So in our next spot, we'll jump more into the coffee so one of the main things that people ask is funds to be honest is not as much as you think and two a good bit of work is required right let me break this down for you right funds wise so how YouTube pays you they pay you at the end of the month through Google Adsense and when, when I mean AdSense, it's basically advertisers run ads on your videos and depending on how many people watch your videos, basically from ads, from memberships, from super thanks, thank you, by the way, whoever gave me a super thanks, I appreciate that so much. Yeah, all that will add up to your YouTube revenue, right? Or uh, what you accumulate. And YouTube would not pay out until you reach a threshold. And the minimum threshold to reach is a hundred US dollars. Let me just say seven hundred Trinidadian dollars, right? So you get paid per thousand views. So for each video, once you have a thousand views on that video, they will pay you uh, roughly like a dollar and fifty cents US. Could be more, could be less, depending on the amount of subscribers you have and the kind of views you get per video. But for me, is is around roughly between a dollar and twenty cents to a dollar and fifty cents US. So let me say that is around $8 per thousand views per video. And I normally put out about four to five videos because I drop videos every Saturday for the month. So some months will have four Saturdays, some months will have five Saturdays. Those so basically four to five videos, eight TT per thousand views on each of those videos. So say on average, I get about 20 to 40,000 views 
a month some months it will be more depending on like if our video do well like the Maruga video if you haven't seen that that was pretty cool or my sugar on us video so on, on those months the money i get from youtube from adsense is p a little more than the regular amount right but that don't happen as often right so on average i get between 20 and say forty thousand views so with that with, with that average youtube roughly pays me between 90 to 110 us so let me say let's round it off to i get around 700 let me say 700 tt a month because they after they take out tax which is 25 percent tax so you guys end up getting say probably 650 trillion dollars for the month that is currently what youtube pays me when i get paid because like i said there's that hundred dollars threshold that you need to meet so some months i may fall short and there are some months i don't get anything at all because i don't meet the threshold so it's not a consistent thing at least for trinbago vibes at the moment when you're taking things like gas the price for doing these videos meaning what if you're going to do food in this case buying coffee and i find this line taking real long boy hey, everybody out and about so when you consider gas when you consider the cost for food when you consider the time this is time here time taken to capture clips to edit clips right the cost of wi-fi alone is about a third of that you know <laughs> It don't add up but anyway the point is right regardless the money made from youtube itself from that aspect from the ad tent is not as much as you would think i just give you a breakdown of what i see from my channel others who have better views more subscribers all these things it might be different right all right let me go let's go collect this pumpkin spice thank you oh yeah Pumpkin spice, wow. So yeah, pumpkin spice frap. Cheers. Ah, this real sweet red. Wow. I'm not a fan, still not a fan. But you know, money spent. So I don't make a set of money from doing this. Just putting that out there. It helps greatly from like donating to PayPal and stuff. That helps tremendously in getting these videos done and of course well all the likes all the comments even sharing them to family and friends it helps growing channel and more views more revenue coming in better videos that i could basically do or i could expand on the range of videos to do because there are some very epic ideas out there some of them it costs a good bit to do now while we head to the next spot which is north or east in this case right i'll give you what my purpose was for trinbago vibes when i now started this channel and how this came about at the next spot right here in trin city our third spot in this drive through drinks episode yeah this is the drive through there that's the entrance to the Starbucks there. Right, so right here now we are at, I have no idea what you call here, to be honest. This is right opposite Trin City Mall. Let me see what Google tells me. Okay, cool. So right now we are at Trin City Plaza, the Starbucks here at Trin City Plaza. It is opposite Trin City Mall up in the east and yeah just ordered this regular plain coffee people ask me this all the time i've probably said this in a video before and i can't remember but what was my purpose or my reason of joining youtube right to do the kind of videos i do well it all went back in this was pre-covid so this is 2019 right which my girlfriend at the time who's currently my, my wife we was planning this big trip to the states right i was on youtube so i was watching a good bit of those videos to see what to do in those places when we get there and well i was doing that and then when the lockdown happened it came to me wait now anybody is do that for trinidad and tobago meaning that showcase or highlight everything trinidad and tobago this is what it is how to get there what to expect kind of thing and that is how i wanted to do 
Trinbago vibes. So that's why I sit down and I was like, all right, what is the purpose of the channel? Channel is to showcase and highlight everything Trinidad and Tobago, as well as to see how far Trinidadian culture is on the outside, outside Trinidad. So that's why you will see some videos where I in Miami, I might, you might see some where in the States. And that essentially is how Trinbago vibes came about. Now, I wasn't sure how I was going to do, if I was going to make money from this, but I told myself, you know what? I'll give myself five years. Let me see how things go in those five years. And so far, <laughs> can't complain. I'm totally grateful for the support. All right, hold on, let me go with this. All right, this is 23 Trinidadian dollars for regular coffee. This is the medium sized one, the grande one, plain black coffee. Wow. Good stuff compared to that sugary pumpkin spice one we had earlier. So that's how Trinbago vibes came about more or less and it is where we are today. Over time, you know, hopefully the videos got better, everything started to progress better. I got better in terms of editing, got better software, got upgraded equipment which I may have to do soon but I'll have to save to do that. So that is a little bit about YouTube and how Trinbago Pipes came about and how we showcase Trinidad and Tobago. Speaking of showcasing, by the way, Yeah, so that was Nova Coffee right here in Starlight Plaza, right in Maraval. As soon as you take the roundabout, like you hit the Salad Road, if you're heading towards Maracas to the North Coast Road from Port Spain side, yeah, it's on the right hand side. So this is Nova Coffee, Ethiopia. Yeah, this is not bad. This is a nice AC type coffee. It's not as strong. This is a eight ounce and I paid 28 Trinidadian dollars for a eight ounce cup of coffee. All right. We have one more spot to go and that's in town itself. Let's head there now. Right on Independence Square, when you swing up Frederick Street, it's right there, like a building down. Right, I've not even a block, a building down and it's a nice little vibe inside there actually. Coffee right here in Port of Spain on Frederick Street. The right, this is what excellent city center. Yeah, excellent city center. Not bad. Pretty good standard coffee. You'll get similar to of the Ethiopian that we had earlier in Starlight. So, yeah, you'll just see people walking behind me. If by chance you see me here on the road or you are one of those walking behind me, let me know in the comments below. Yeah, so they have some tables here on the outside, right outside. So you can still come on, sit down and enjoy some good coffee. And they also have some pastries as well. But this one strictly drinks strictly coffee. So those were two coffee, local coffee shops here in Trinidad and Tobago. Mm, granted, one of them is like, uh, the prices. Mm. But anyway, we've tackled three drive throughs We chat about YouTube a little bit. And we've seen two local coffee shops. I'm on my way to the final one here, another drive through Last time I was in this spot, they didn't have any of their brewed coffee. Let's see if I get lucky this time around. I'm referring to Paz drive through just, just to get a regular coffee, their brewed coffee. You all have any brewed coffee? Yes, we do. I want to get a um, 12 ounce brewed coffee. This drive through it will come out by phase two pannier by the way as soon as you collect the drink and when you come around you come around to one woodbrook side onto damien street yeah so we chat about youtube a little bit now this is not to discourage anybody from starting their youtube channel right thank you so much have a good day same to you all but just be aware things may not always go according to plan I mean, if you are consistent and you develop your videos, you have good ideas, you know, it may work out. And I pray it does. This is Trinbago Vibes. Hope you enjoyed that one. Hmm. 
coffee is not as strong as I'd like, but mm, as a brewed coffee, tastes closer to Americano. Anyway, hope you enjoyed that one. That drive through wasn't bad at all. By the way, if you didn't check out the past video, you can check that out here. And don't forget to hit that subscribe button. And you know, I'm gone. Let us.